with the days that God created, God gave meaning to each and every day. Our ancestors knew all this and they understand the meaning of it. As a result of that, they came out with uh, Mondays, Monday, this, Tuesdays, this, in connection with the days that God created the world. So God does everything for a purpose. Our ancestors also do things for a purpose. They don't just do this anyhow, no haphazard, but they do things for a purpose. I'm so happy that it took place and uh, you've also learned something. That is why we are here, of course. That's why we are here to learn. Learn the culture. As for the history, we all know some. Learn the culture. Uh, see the people, interact with the people. And then when you go back, change their bad mentality. As I told you, uh, someone wanted to know where the African slaves, the tree in which African slaves. But later the person got to know that uh, he has been educated wrongly. He called the mom and said, what he told me is not true. <laughs> and I was very happy about that. So let's be ambassadors for this nation. Thank you. Someone else, and someone share with us um, yesterday naming ceremony, what it means to you. to go there so you know it's giving serious feedback <laughs> okay that our great grandparents gave to us. There are other names also that goes with it. And some of these names depict so many things. In the Akan tradition, we also have totems. And these totems goes with the names and then the clan. Everyone belongs to a clan. And in the clan, we have the chief linguist who always have the clan stick in his hands. If you were to see a chief sitting in states, you will love it. All does the white lenses from us. His administration, right hand man, left hand man, those behind him, the two career, the uh, uh, language, and every, everyone has a certain part to play in the community. And in the state also, they have a certain place that they sit. We don't sit anyhow. That doesn't mean that women also are not included. They are. They also have their own a set of administrators all around them and they have the way they sit down the way they talk what i'm talking so when we are getting there please just oh you don't know that i'm going to let you have so that uh, uh, by the time we realize you are past whilst i'm yeah, talking yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'll let you. I, know, I, know, I know i know the place all right i know it's too, but, but yeah i wasn't looking for you <laughs> okay. So with the totems, totems, they look at a certain animal and its character that depicts the people. For example, falcon, the bird falcon is known as, is the totem for Oyuku family. Oyuku family. We have either eight 
or southern clans in the Akan uh, traditional system. And what does falcon do? Falcon is a peaceful animal, very quiet. So the family is a very quiet and peaceful We have leopard. We have crow. Who is Asane? Uh, we have Oyuku, Asane. This is the first round. Oh, we went to your site. We passed the school. But you're called a site one. Oh, okay. Yeah.